Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, guys. Celtic Warband here, and after a long wait, I'm finally getting back into my High Elves campaign for Warhammer 2. I've just been pretty busy this week with school. Uh, my schedule changes weekly for university. It's really annoying, so one week I could have a bunch of half days and have some time to record, and then the next week I just have full days all day. So, uh, yeah, but we're actually just on the verge of getting rid of the chaos from our lands once and for all. Uh, well, that is until the next ritual comes to pass. I do have this small army here with some Phoenix Guard and some Lothar and Sea Guard with shields. Don't remember ever making this army or sending it up here, but I'm glad I did because this army with the four trolls is sieging the White Tower of Hoeth. Uh, a lot of attrition though, which is good. However, this really small army is in forced march, and if I attack it with this army, I don't think they're going to be able to uh, get reinforcements from the one that's the sieging. So I don't think I'm in forced march. Let's go ahead and see what we can do there. Okay, that's kind of interesting that they're, it's actually going to bring out all of these other units, Another so time. we're going to retreat from that. And... Quite impossible. See if we can move like around way. this way. Princess of Althran. And then can we come out Attack. against this army? Attack. Okay, well, actually, we're going to get the garrison force and everybody involved in this anyways. It's a, We have a pretty formidable army here. The only thing I'm worried about is the trolls, but we do have a lot of archers that we can focus focus down all of these. Or, sorry, these are not trolls. They, these are giants. These are trolls. Sorry. Yeah, so all of those chaos giants we should be able to focus down. We've also got uh, two bolt throwers as well, which is excellent, and a solid amount of cavalry. So, uh, I'll see you guys on the battlefield. Welcome to the battlefield, guys. And the reinforcements for myself are coming in right in behind us, as you can see. But I've actually deployed further down closer to my reinforcements because the enemy reinforcements were coming right from my side. And I do actually have this on slow motion for now. But, yeah, you can see that we've got the chaos trolls coming in over here. Uh, it's only 48 of them, so I'm not super concerned about these reinforcements. But I've also got a couple of units of my cavalry over here as well. Just to get rid of them quickly enough, which is, which is basically the plan. So I've got all these extra units here, which are going to make a really nice uh, front line. So I'm going to kind of form them up right in front if I can, or actually I probably won't even be able to, so I'm going to try and form them up in a nice line behind here. Uh, bolt throwers, let's target right in the center there where they're all kind of converging. And I should actually probably lock all of these because I do not want them moving. This next front line I'll leave unlocked for now. Let's get all of our Lothern Sea Guard as a fourth line. And this cavalry, which is right here, let's move them up onto the hills here. What do they have that they're firing against me with? Oh, that's probably their lord. It's causing some problems, but I think we can put it on play because everybody's moving at this point. But yeah, we're really picking apart these trolls. Which is what I want. Serve the king. And I guess that's all? Like, where's their lord that they had over here for this reinforcement army? Not exactly sure, but the main fight is definitely going to be coming over on this side. Princess of Althorn. Got my noble over here as well. Keep firing right into... Right into the infantry, we can take down the giants easily enough just by focusing them down. Here comes the cavalry, but we're not even going to worry about that. There's another giant there. Let's 
Where's the Lothurn Sea Guard going? I thought I told you guys to form up back here. And with you guys, I'm going to lock and attack. Ah, we found some found some knights over here that were looking to hide. And we've got the noble over here. He can come out and help over here. That's a giant, so send this other noble over here to help. Where's my other silver helms? Let's, let's get a nice flanking charge on these chaos knights here. And I'm really going to try and work to get some more cinematic charges for you guys because I know that I kind of zoom out quite a bit. It's just because I'm trying to minimize my losses as best I can. Oh my gosh. But yeah, let me select uh, let me select my Lothar and Seaguard here. Understood. We got to focus these giants as best as we can. Without question. We advance. And let's uh, unlock these guys, pull them back to fire. Good, those trolls are starting to break, which is excellent. You guys go after them. And let's go back into the fight here. Eagle Claw. Yeah, Eagle Claws will continue will focusing Loyal. the remainder of the forces. Glittering host. Glittering host, yes. I think this is going to be the last of the Chaos Incursion. Let's try and zoom right in here to the carnage. Oh my goodness, these trolls are just slaughtering my white lions. But over here we're victorious, so... Yes. Let's all get in behind. Yeah, just charge in to the back of this, these Chaos Warriors here. Kill them all. Who's pulling back right now? Who's retreating? My Cav. Ooh, that's not good. Oh, there we go. There's the victory, though. Yeah, keep pressing on, though. Keep firing at that general. Um, we have some cab over here. I completely forgot about my cab on this flank, but I think that I think that my archer cavalry Wherever they are they did well they slaughtered the the chaos spawn Or sorry the chaos trolls Over here my cab is breaking that chaos cavalry unfortunately looks like it's gonna get away But I think that that is it And look at the glorious host. Kane! This is for Alistair. The brave Alistair the White Lion. That died against... Against those Skaven so long ago. We should have sent him to Sartosa. Yeah, slaughter them. Beautiful, beautiful. There's just like one more warrior over here. Serve the king. Silver held. Where's the uh, general? It was their, their lord was killed, I'd imagine? Or is this him over here? Guys, Northern guys. Everyone over here. It will be done. Assyrian guides us. Swiftly. Let's get this cavalry over here to cut him off so he doesn't escape. We can fast forward, though. Oh, is he going to escape? No! Stop him! Oh my gosh, you're going to let him get away. Oh, I can't believe that. 
You lucky dog. All right, decisive victory. I'll see you guys back on the campaign map. Rejoice! All right, nice bit of loot Put there, the and we held on to all of our units, which is excellent. And we're going to take uh, the 5% replenishment. And it looks like they're just going to escape, but they are very weak. Stole a banner from they the enemy as well. Time is of the essence. And can we just go get rid of them? Put them to death. And if we lose that unit, yeah, that's all right. A Lost one unit Oathman. of white lions. Put them in fetters. And another 3k. Wow. So we're making some good money. Hold the captives. Which is good because we're going to need Hold it to replenish our forces. Faction destroyed. Beautiful. So Treading you're going to head up me. over here. Actually, can you just stop there for a minute? See if you can get a white lion. You cannot. Well, you've got four white lions. You've got a bunch of these archers. Good amount of cav. But 19 out of 20, so that's fine. Yeah, so just head over there. Lady of Ulthorn. You garrison. Taking up residence. Near or in the White Tower. Okay, so now we need to start Defend building back up. Queen. So let's colonize Gale Vale or Gay and Vale. Let's get that going. At Evershile, I built uh, up to the second tier, and we're getting the docks. And at Tor Air, let's get our walls. And I noticed this building here, the Royal Illyrian Stables. We're going to get that because that's going to help us with our income. And that's actually going to give us an extra 400 income as well per turn. So that is good. Uh, they're going to treasure hunt for me next turn. And actually, we're going to start to go after all of these shipwrecks instead of going to the White Tower. Moving out. Because we've got, I think, two or three in here. Four, actually. Uh, interesting Lethal pieces grace there. Lethal grace actually, if we... If we... Force march here, we should be able to get that uh, this turn, actually. Lightning swift. This is rank madness. Um, let's get better campaign movement. Trunk of maps and a shield of Tolos. Across the waves. Doing pretty good. That's 553, five, so we can actually get rid of that building. We don't even need that anymore. Um, Tor Anrock. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 man. Okay. I serve the Phoenix King. I did not see Black this, so Nagarond. Tor Anlik does not have walls. Why does it not have walls? Okay, we're going to cancel that then. What is this? Income from all buildings. Wow, see, we need that for sure. Citadel of Anlik. Dreadlord of Nagaroth. Okay, so are we at war with them? We are not at war with them, though, but that doesn't mean that they're not going to stab us in the back. You require assistance? Because they are at war with Nagarond. Deliver your terms, and I shall consider them. And they are definitely not interested. Lord of the Phoenix. All are given a fair hearing in the Phoenix Court. Futile. Ugh. Why does no one want to confederate? I don't understand. Misguided. Whatever. Okay, well, hopefully they're not coming for me. That's... That would be bad. But everything else has walls over here. Same goes for over here. And you're at five and three, so... Don't need that growth building either. Peace. Until next time. You're going after that. Prince of Elf. And oh my goodness, they're down to like seven men. They need to replenish quite a bit. 
Shrine of Cain, you need an upgrade as well. Bowmaster, so we're giving you some buffs basically to your forces. Great Eagles and Phoenix and Dragon units. Swordmasters of Hoeth, Dragon Princes, Archers, Lothar, and Seaguard Bolt Throwers. Spearmen and Archers. So I think we'll go for that because she's going to be a lower tier army. Protector of the Everqueen. At Missnar, we can actually already go up to level 3, which is excellent. My infinite knowledge is yours. And can we select that as a war coordination target for you? And do you have any armies over here? You do not. Okay, well, we'll uh, look to get that Illyrian stables as soon as we can. Like, or I guess we could get the orchards, but do I have anything that I want to delete here? Do I really need this here? Tower of Mages? Because I think I have that somewhere else. Yeah, I've got the Tower of Mages over here. So let's get rid of that so that we can put the Illyrian special building in. And you've leveled up as A well. Promising lieutenant. So you're also going for Militia Master. Uh, let's put you on an eagle. And I think that's pretty much anything. Time we got another assigned effort. skill points. Oh, she's got two. Okay, I see. Let's give her some magic resistance. The Menagerist? Really? Is the Order of Loremasters going to listen to what I have to say? I'd be shocked if that's the case, but... Okay, concerned about Nagron, though. I don't think I have the strength to be able to oppose them. And population in Sartosa. Nice. Oh, here's the Ag Hall. Okay, what are they going to do? One's leaving, which is excellent. Got a factory here. Is Beautiful. Okay, so let's treasure hunt first. Deeper than the ruins lies an abandoned Skaven burrow. Everything inside is covered in a thin layer of warp dust. The floor is littered with bits of machinery, and a strange green light glows. Green glow lights a darkened corner. Just what have the perfidious rat spawn been doing here? Let's study the machinery. Uh, minus three public order. Man, I really do not have good luck with Absolutely. treasure hunts. Navigating. There we go. 5k to the treasury. That's pretty huge. Uh, so... I'm going to send Setting you sail. over this way. Because we're going to need to get another army over here if we Protector can. And we need to start Elf. building up this army too. So... I feel like should maybe get some military buildings over here. How long until this can upgrade? Soon. Um. Uh, da -da -da -da. We could get walls there. Is there anything we need to build over here? Champion Not currently. This nobles level there up as still well. Is legend. He's already got immortality, which is excellent. His replenished troops is maxed out, so I guess we're just buffing him up now. Let's give him some more armor. Never. We got a 14 stack Never. over here. High law master. Okay, can you go after them, please? Like, where are all these armies of Nagaron going? 
together. But Tor Anlik is working on some walls, which is good. I'm wondering if I should throw something in here so I can get some some archers or some white lions over on this side. Probably a good idea to do that. And over here the we're still building up. Well. I'm waiting. Guardian of the Phoenix Crown. You can Protector come on over here. Go for uh Prince of Elfwan. Tor Seror. And then after you're done at Torfino, you can go to Shadow Peak. I think it's just because I'm not really strong. Oh, oh, what happened here? Did you guys lose your armies or something? Yeah, you must have lost all your armies because you're way weaker than you used to be now. I bet you you're going to be what brings you very to interested court? in Confederation now. Yes, yes you are. Huzzah! Confederation. Okay, so how's our... We're still looking pretty good. And that's uh, way down here. So let's zip on over there. Take a look at what we got here. Uh, let's bring you back. Actually, we got a lot of treasures over here. Okay, so wow, this is really good over here. Everything's maxed out. Um, don't need that. Got a port there, which is fine. Does this give... It lo unlocks recruitment of... Income from all ports plus 10%. Okay. All right, well, that's fine. Uh, I would actually like to get some walls in here, though. So I got rid of that, which is good. And we can get some Lothar and Seaguard here if we wanted. That provides a mage as a garrison. Unlocks recruitment. Now I'm going to put walls there instead. I'm wondering if I should get rid of this or that. Like, am I ever really going to build an army from here? Probably not. Okay, I'll leave it. I'll leave this for now, but can anybody tell me in the comments, do these stack here? So if he has two elven embassies for his ports, does that mean that we're making 20% income? Because it says all regions in this province... But is he stacking them? Like, is that possible per province? Because if not, I'll get rid of that. But if it is stacking, then I'll probably just get rid of uh, this here and possibly get rid of that and put another elven embassy in here. But yeah, let me know. Let me know your thoughts over there, guys. But that should have made us more powerful than the Order of Lore Masters. Our strength rank is two. His is five. And it is deteriorating with us. But that's only the Confederation penalty that we're... Yeah, so minus 40 with the High Elves and minus 8 Public Order. Further Confederations will not be possible while this is in effect. How many turns is that? Five. Okay, well, that's not too bad. And everything is at 100% uh, anyways, so we can afford a little, a little drawback if necessary. And what were we planning to put here? Oh, because I just deleted... Uh, yes, I deleted that, so... Should probably get that Elven Embassy in there. That's really going to help us make a lot of money. And you're gone, because I don't need you. You can go up. Actually, scratch that. Let me see if we can build up anything over here that we may need at Tor Enlik. They're okay for now. So then, where was that Tor Elair? We were going to get that. Okay, so have I... I haven't ended the turn yet. So I got an unassigned skill point with this prince. Let's give him sword player. Commandment available. 
Ah, okay, so... I think we're just gonna put this on income and trade, basically. Since I don't have to build anything. That's gonna be a cash cow. Oh yes, I forgot. Forgot about him. 2,500 and some experience. Nice. So he's gained a rank. Phoenix Gate has a surplus. Power of Nagaron, though. That is insane. Oh, snap. Okay, forward trespass it. The only good thing is maybe they'll take out some of the Order of Loremaster's territory in the Isle, and then I can swoop in and take it, but I am pretty much debilitated with my War with Chaos, so to have all of these armies from Nagaron come forwards, that's just not a good thing. Where is this full stack going? Oh my goodness. That is a strong army, too. Princess of Althuan. Um, okay, we're gonna turn Demon. you around, actually. Lady of the Phoenix Court. Okay, where are we trespassing? Ooh. I serve the Phoenix King. What are you guys doing? Guardian of the Phoenix Crown. Marching out. Garrisoning. I hope they're not going after the shrine. Can I offer assistance? I'm not going to be happy with that, that's for sure. Charting a course. Direct me. For order. Okay, let's treasure hunt here. While searching the ruins of a site known to have been corrupted by the dark powers, your retainers come across a patch of fungus. Some believe we should harvest the spores, while others warn that they were sent by Slanish. A reasonable conclusion to draw when the Chaos Gods are abroad. Let's continue searching. Oh, well that was... That was basically useless. Bloodshed becomes me. Oh my gosh, they have a very scary army. Lady of the Phoenix I do have the money. I should probably try and get some units in here. It's going to take three turns to get them. Can get some spears. Lothar and Seaguard with shields I could get. That's like 4k though, that's so expensive. Oh man. Oh, they're sieging over here. At Tor Anrock, okay. I serve the Phoenix King. So yeah, you're headed over that Help way. Lothurn, so if we come back to the the tower. A mighty warrior. Yes, let's give you a steed there. Setting up garrison. Can we can't build anything just yet? Oh man, I wish we could attack this army with our garrison. We stand ready for action. Two, three, four, five, six units of archers. Let's merge them to two and get two of them. And let's see, unassigned skill points again. Replenishes hit points. Spirit Leech, damage to multiple combatants.
Defender of the Ever Queen. Sailing yeah, away. Let's get this on the way back. They have a moon dragon in this army. Wow. Um, let's say battle, because I'm a little bit, a <laughs> little bit nervous about what we're going to find. Journeying on. That Nagaron does. Oh, they're at seven minus seven. Let's get you guys your walls. So your guys' garrisons, like Tora Laser, is solid. Tower of the Sun is uh, where I think we're building our walls. So the Tower of the Stars is a little bit undefended. So I will have to probably get rid of one of these. But to be honest, I'm actually not going to. I'll just wait and see if you guys have anything to say about that. Uh, hero not moved. Oh, this hero's mine now? No, no kidding. What? Is this mine? This is mine too? What? Do I have something over here that's mine? Oh, so they took Zlatlan. Oh. I serve the king. How can I assist you? Hey, well, you got walls there. You got that elven thing for the port. And you built a dragon. Dragon lair. Uh, how is the garrison there? Pretty solid, so I guess Loyal we'll just hold prince. out there for now. Considering I can only build uh, dragons here. But we do have 6k, so I should probably start building another force. And I think I'm going to do that with this general over here. Build a nice, solid uh, force of, of Phoenix Guard and White Lions. Or, sorry, uh, of the uh, Swordmasters of Hoeth. Ready to serve. Now, is this all that's left of my super elite army that I was building for Tyrion? That must be. So I must have Princess lost all of my... All of my good units out of there. Oh, that's that's sucky. Ah, oh, see, this is what happens when I don't uh, play for a while. I forget what happened or what I was planning to do. All right, hero not moved, so um, I guess we'll just embed you for now. And we have a research available as well. Porcelain kins income from settlements plus ten percent. Yes, please. Settlement upgrade available. Ah, yes, okay. What do we need? We can get some exotic animals in here. Let's go ahead and do that. And end the turn. And we're going to wrap it up after Nagaron does. I'm pretty nervous because they have landed on the Shrine of Cain. I don't know where else they would be going except to attack me, unless they're coming up to attack the Order of Lore Masters by coming around the aisle. But I do not want to get Nagaron. Oh, they're ridding me now. Oh, that's so annoying. I am quick to anger and slow to forgive. He's probably declaring war on me. Peace treaty. Well, you're at war with the Order of Lore Masters. But I don't have any territory near you at all. So... Will you give me money for it? You, uh, you have to give me three grand or it's no deal, man. Okay, well... Whatever. Speak your poisoned word and be gone. Oh, yeah, what do you want to? Peace treaty with you? Are you guys a horde or something? We have spilled enough elven blood. Let there be peace. Uh, nope. I do not forgive easily. Well, I didn't forgive you at all, so. Uh, settlement besieged. Are you serious right now? You're putting me in the negative because you're sieging me? Ball, lend us your strength. Oh my goodness, why do they have such good odds? It must be done. Really? How can I assist you? The will is done. For all 
Order. There, that's a little more even. We have a dragon. Like, how is... They've got a bunch of these Globadiers, but I've got Dragon Princes. I could easily ri ride them down. And they got a bunch of Plague Monks, but they're not going to be as good as my infant. We definitely got this. They must but die. I'm going to leave that they for all. next episode. So hopefully you guys did enjoy. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you'd like to see more content like this in the future. And I will see you in the next one.